Hi, I just registered for sponsored products and now I'm ready to start driving more traffic to my Amazon product listings. I can do that by setting up campaigns that will target Amazon customer search results based on keywords. I can create many different kinds of campaigns depending on what I want to accomplish. For instance, I want to create a campaign that will feature products that I'm listing for the first time. I also want campaigns that are seasonal or based on holidays when my products are in greater demand. I can set up campaigns for a specific time period or I can choose to leave the end date open. I can add new ad groups, products and keywords at any time. Before I create a campaign, I need to decide how much I want to spend on the campaign, how long I want it to run, and what types of products I want to include in the campaign. For example, I have a budget of about Rs 18,000 per quarter for my campaigns promoting our new kitchen appliances and bed and bath products. From this I have determined that I have a daily budget of approximately rupees 200 that I can use over a 90 day period. So my daily budget will be rupees 200. Once I have determined my budget and campaign schedule, I'll be ready to create ad groups. An ad group is a collection of similar products that will share the same keywords and default bid. I'm creating an ad group for a new line of bath towels I'm selling. Next, I set my default bid. This is how much I'm willing to pay when someone clicks my ads to view and purchase my products. A winning bid will create an ad impression, but I only pay when a customer clicks the ad. When I win a bidding auction, I pay one pesa more than the next highest bid. So if my winning bid is rupees 7 and the next highest bid is rupees 5, I only pay rupees 5.01 if someone clicks my ad. If I'm creating a campaign with automatic targeting, I'm done because Amazon will automatically use all relevant customer search keywords to target my products in my ad group. But if I'm creating a campaign with manual targeting, I still need to add keywords to my ad group. These are the words that Amazon uses to target my ads to customer searches. I can add up to 1000 keywords and can use words that Amazon recommends, enter my own or use a combination of both. If I select my own, I want to make sure that the keywords are relevant to the products in my ad group and that the reference product detail page metadata. The more keywords I select, the better chance I have of receiving ad impressions and clicks. One more option to keep in mind when working with sponsored products is the account daily budget cap. This gives me the option to enter a maximum daily budget for all of my campaigns. If I do set one, I want to make sure that I do not enter a value that is smaller than any daily budget for a single campaign. For instance, if I enter a value of Rs 200 here and I have several campaigns with a daily budget of Rs 280, then all of my campaigns will stop running when my daily spend across campaigns reaches Rs 200 and I lose opportunities to target searches with my ads. For my campaigns, I'm going to leave the account daily budget cap field empty for my account. Now that I have shown you the components of a sponsored products campaign, I'll show you how I can use the campaign manager in Seller Central to create a campaign with automatic targeting or manual targeting. Click the links below to get started.